God is love. You must believe in God before you have proof. Or God spoke to me in a dream. Or I have personal experience with God and Jesus. I'm completely 100% tired that people keep using those kind of claims, faith-based or personal testimony or love. It's not proof. If I ask you for proof and evidence, you must provide actual tangible proof and evidence that your God exists. Period. I've been lenient these past few months, but now I'm sick and tired of it. I'm done. So, for now, if anybody asks me to believe in God and believe in Jesus because of their personal experience or because of faith or you name it, I'm going to end the discussion there. I will, if it's on YouTube, I will comment on this stuff and tell them that you cannot explain your belief system rationally and logically. Faith-based claims is just gullibility and personal testimony and eyewitness accounts is not proof of anything. Period. You're done. I'm done talking to you. If you want to continue this conversation, please. Explain why you believe rationally and give me proof and evidence, actual proof and evidence that your God exists. Period. Your God isn't love because no loving God will do the things that He's done, Yahweh's done in the Bible. No loving God would drown in His creation. No loving being would, would sacrifice Himself to Himself to appease Himself for the rules that He made for Himself instead of just forgiving us. No. A loving God would just forgive instantly and forget instantly. That's it. But no. Yahweh doesn't. He needs blood in order to forgive. He needs blind faith in order for people to go to heaven. No. No loving God would create hell. No loving God would create a being of supposed evil, Satan. No loving God would do that. Ignorance is a bliss.